Hi, my name is Emily Nguyen and I am a part-time letter page for the East Anaheim branch. And here are some of the books on my to-be-read list. So starting with the first one is um, Tangled Vines, Power, Privilege, and the Murdoch Family Murders by John Black. And it basically follows a case in South Carolina where Paul Murdoch uh, is the son of a very powerful family. Uh, it's like a family full of like prestigious lawyers and an incident occurs one day where the boat crashes and Murdoch's girlfriend Mallory dies and it basically kind of follows up on how people suspect that power and privilege must have gone into play of um, um, covering up maybe his um, inclusion into Mallory's um, death. I thought it was really interesting. I saw a docu-series on Netflix about it, and when I saw the book, I was like, oh, I'll read this one instead. So the second book I have is called You Have a Match by Emma Lord, and it's basically about a girl named Abby, and she thinks that she knows a lot of things about her life, and she decides to sign up for this DNA service where um, her, initial, her initial prompt was that she wanted to set up her friends, but um, she actually ends up finding out that she has a sister somewhere um, out there named Savannah and Savannah is like this Instagram pop star, totally complete opposite from Abby and so her sensible decision was I'm gonna do a summer camp and find out more about her sister and try to unravel family secrets. The third book I have is called Once Upon a Broken Heart by Stephanie Gardner and I heard a lot of stuff about this. It is a YA romance fantasy novel and it basically follows a girl named Evangeline Fox and she found out one day that the love of her life was going to marry someone else so she struck a deal with someone called the Prince of Hearts and I think he promises her three kisses in exchange for his help and she, I think after the first kiss she was like oh I'm gonna regret this or maybe it's gonna be a really good thing. The fourth book I have here which I'm most excited to read because it was recommended to me by a friend it's called Pachinko by Min Jin Lee. Um, I really love like heartbreaking emotional books so once I heard about this I was really excited to read it. But it basically follows a girl named Sunja. She is born and raised in a Korean family. One day she gets pregnant and she gets pregnant from a wealthy fish broker who betrays her so she ends up having to find someone else and she eventually finds someone named Isak and he agrees to marry her and they move to Japan where this is where she gets the full experience of being Korean in Japan and it's apparently a really heartbreaking story so yeah. The last book I have is called The Oceans and the Stars by Mark Halprin and this book I picked it up today but it follows a guy named Steven and he's a navy captain and it's another story about love and war um, he ends up getting um, positioned to the mid mid-east and he meets a girl named Katie and he falls in love with her and just when things are good war breaks out and things get hard so yeah these are my books thank you for watching